Hi, I'm Renan. I'm Jazzy. And you're our friend. <laughs> As you can see, we got two little signs that have Renan and Jazzy. So today we're playing Who's Most Likely To Whatever Challenge. And so the way this is gonna work, just for an example, I'm gonna ask who's most likely to put an empty water bottle back in the fridge. And I'm gonna say, Jazzy. You know it's you. <laughs> so we hold up Jazzy, Renan, and we'll see what we say. <laughs> so I have a few written down, Jazzy has a few written down, we don't know what each other wrote, so we'll see how this goes. But first, coffee. This is not a paid sponsored commercial ad, but Terra Mia coffee, they are really good. <laughs> we found them yesterday. <laughs> And we got, we got it again today, so so we like it. <laughs> so if if anyone sees this that works at Tiramia, we'd so appreciate it if we got some more coffee, like tomorrow or something <laughs> like that. I don't know. If that could happen, praise God for that. That would be so cool. <laughs> That's good. Okay. So I'm going to go first, right? I don't have these in any specific order, so here we go. Who is most likely to go to McDonald's and ask for a Happy Meal with extra happy? Not me, but I'm going to be done. <laughs> I just, okay, so the reasoning, I'm saying me. Why are you, okay, hold on, why are you saying me? Because you're not saying you. Oh, one, I wouldn't go to McDonald's. <laughs> we go get ice cream all the time. Oh, we don't get Happy Meals. Yeah, I wouldn't get the food from there. Well, the only reason. I do, that's something that you. <laughs> See, the thing is, it's something I would do, but here's the thing, Jazzy just doesn't order. So I, I would end up doing that. So there it is. Next to it. That is a good start off. <laughs> okay, go ahead. Am I, are we going like back and forth? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Is that how I said it? Okay. No, it's not how you said it. Okay. <laughs> okay, who is most likely to go skinny dipping in winter when it's snowy? <laughs> are you serious? <laughs> no, okay. this one. <laughs> Can I do that? Is there a... Hey, okay, nobody's gonna You have go. to answer. No Who's reason. most likely to go skinny dipping in winter when it's snowing? Okay, okay, nobody in the right mind <laughs> would do that. Nobody. So why is this even a, you know, this? Yeah, I'm gonna just say it. Jazzy would. Would I really in the cold? Would I really in the cold? You don't think anything's gonna <laughs> Maybe I would. Maybe cool. I would. <laughs> you don't like wearing clothes. Hey, Jazzy, you can't just tell tell everyone this. All right, I would. I would. Okay. <laughs> okay. Next question. Bless you. Who is most likely to go to PetSmart, buy birdseed, and ask the clerk how long will it take for the birds to grow? Yes! Yes! <laughs> First of all, who's most likely to go to PetSmart? Jazzy, that's just right off the bat. Then find some bird seed and hope that the birds will grow. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> this is no fan. You can't just ban yourself. <laughs> I do what I want. <laughs> is that please? Who is most likely to fall off the stairs while holding a cake? While well, holding a cake? Okay, well, fall off the stairs. It's the same, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> it's me. Okay, one quick story. We went to Wava Grill. I got the food. I like pick up the tray. I go over, I gotta get the sauces. So I set the tray kind of like halfway on the counter. Boom, the tray, it just falls on the ground. Yeah, that was like the biggest upsetting moment. It was like, Wava Grill's not cheap. It's like 20 some dollars for two of us. It was the most expensive Wava Grill that we've ever gotten. 40 some dollars for Wava Grill. So yeah, I would probably drop a cake going down the stairs. I thought maybe you would have said me because I always fall down the stairs. You know what? But if I was holding a cake, I wouldn't fall. Yeah. That's why I said you. Who's most likely to buy ice cream, then ask the cashier if they believe in unicorns. Then squish the cone on, on your head. <laughs> Let me ask that again. Let me just ask that again. Who's most likely to buy ice cream, ask the cashier if they believe in unicorns, then squish the cone on your head. 
Are you serious? Yeah, it would probably be me. I mean, I can't. <laughs> I wouldn't do that. I can't see you doing that. But I just thought that'd be funny. I just do. You have that image in your head. You have that little cone. You. Go, I'm a unicorn. No. It's <laughs> just me? I would do that. I would so do that. I just want to see the cashier's face. How come all my questions just reflect back on me? <laughs> I already know my answer. Okay, this one I mentioned like a crush. Okay. But obviously like okay, just I mean get you. like yeah. Okay, so who's most likely to embarrass themselves in front of a crush? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 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 Why do you say me? Well, I just, I, I don't know. Well, I don't know. I just can't see myself embarrassing myself. <laughs> what do you see me doing? I mean, I, so I just can't put me. I have to put you. I just, I'm not going to get embarrassed. That's, that's my thing. What do you see me doing? I don't know. What do you see you doing? Then you put you. <laughs> what do you I spit Boba up his car. Oh gosh. Yeah. I can see that being embarrassing, but it wasn't embarrassing. I came up through my nose. <laughs> This is like, how many weeks did I know you? I don't know, it was before we were even together. Yeah. No, you knew me for like over a month then. Okay, so I knew her for a month. She spit up boba in, in the car. <laughs> through her nose. <laughs> <laughs> Who is most likely to be the one to look for something, then realize it was in your hand the whole time? This is a hard one, because we've both have done it. done it but I feel like I would do it more I look for stuff all the time especially my phone especially my keys it's true one time Jazzy I think I poked her butt and like I just went boop and she's like I know you took it I'm like <laughs> like took what I got so confused I know you took it I'm like took what she's like you took my phone I'm like your phone's in your hand <laughs> to become a farmer a farmer <laughs> definitely not jazzy i'm gonna just put me because it's just definitely not her like why, why why is that funny to you though why is that funny why do you put my name <laughs> yeah you know, i just can't see jazzy getting dirty out in the farm i can see her feeding chickens <laughs> I can see her feeding goats, but when it comes to having to like milk the cow or like like pick up poop, like there's no way I could see Jazzy doing that one. She's she's too much of a princess. I, it's like I well I, I wouldn't make her do that either. I, I just I couldn't let her do that. I feel like if someone needed to be the farmer, you would step up. <laughs> like if there was a mass farmers needed and it's mandatory, it would be me. <laughs> Who is most likely to be the one to keep laughing after everyone else has stopped laughing? <laughs> it's definitely Jazzy. He <laughs> just he <it> just he <laughs> <it> just stop. <laughs> okay, it's definitely okay. her. She will laugh and laugh and laugh and laugh. And then when you think she's done, she keeps on laughing. <laughs> Who's most likely to follow people around a store and spray everything they touch with with disinfectant? That's, that's just a, this is a weird one. I, I feel like, can you imagine being like followed in a store and then uh, you go touch a candle and then you go touch like a can, uh, like a towel and then like someone's behind you going I just wouldn't follow people. Yeah, okay. Who is most likely to be the cool parent? Did you see you? Yeah, I did. I'm the cool parent. She's the loving parent. I'm the cool parent. I also think you're gonna be the strict parent though. <laughs> well, with coolness comes great strictness. I don't know. I don't know. I just feel like you're gonna be such the, the caring, the comforting, the, the everything. Like, our kids are just gonna want to go to you so much. Like, mommy, I had this problem at school. Like, mommy, I need help with this. Like, mommy, I, can you help me with my homework? And me, I'm just gonna... <laughs> I said, yeah. like, with my homework. Yeah, I don't know why they have an accident. Like, we, we don't even have an you accident. You sound like Donkey yeah. from the <laughs> <laughs> like an accident. So... <laughs> Can you help me with my... Yeah, can you can you make waffles for me? Like... Can you make me some waffles? Waffles? <laughs> me? They're gonna go, Dad, can we go for a hike? Like, Dad, can we... I don't know, race... Race? Like, Dad, can we go out and play hoops? 
<laughs> but you know what? If they come out like, like I don't know, like, like Dad, I want to draw. I'm like, well, mm -hmm. can you go do that with your mom? Like, <laughs> I'm not a good drawer. We just... <laughs> <laughs> so maybe I wouldn't be the fun parent. No, I, <laughs> I think you're very fun naturally, <laughs> but the things you're listing, you're just. <laughs> Let's dig a hole. It depends how they are. Who would most likely buy false eyelashes and wear them as a mustache? <laughs> I would say this because why? <laughs> because why would I do it? I can just grow one. But you, you have lashes and you just kind of move them from here to here. It'd be so funny. But why would I buy them to do that? Well, no, you have them already and then you just move them to your lip. You're like right here. It's you. You would most likely do it. I wouldn't. Yes, you would. She would. Who is most likely to remain asleep while the alarm is blaring? Oh my gosh. <laughs> this is an easy one. <laughs> Who's more likely to dress up as an M&M and run through a store or mall yelling, The Skittles are coming! <laughs> I don't know where. Right? <laughs> you make up these things. <laughs> all the things. The Skittles are coming! The Skittles are coming! All the things that you're making up are only things that you would think of. <laughs> Who is most likely able to tell a better story? I think Jazzy too. But I have a story, a prompt, to, to really find this out, okay? So, here it is. <laughs> what happened to Mommy Long Legs? <laughs> tell us, Jazzy. What is your best... Your best impromptu, you're like on the spur of the moment. Here it is. Let me think for a second. Okay, I'm gonna think for a second. I haven't thought of this. Did you? I haven't thought of it. So I'm gonna think of a story. Okay, I got one. You really haven't? You thought of it already. No, I didn't think of it. Can Go give ahead. me a second. You've been talking the whole time. Okay, we'll just stay here and let her think. You're distracting me from thinking. Oh, come on. I'll just put it out there. Okay, fine. What's yours? No, no, no. I, I need to hear yours because no, I need to hear you yours. put you put your name. Come on. Okay, well, let me hear yours first. Yeah, but is it gonna inspire yours? No. Okay, here it is. Here's my story. This is what happened to Mommy Long Legs, because we all know that Daddy Long Legs is still around. Mommy Long Legs is the one that climbed up the water spout. The itsy bitsy spider was Mommy Long Legs. Okay, am I doing this right? Yeah, yeah. So the itsy bitsy spider was Mommy Long Legs. And Mommy Long Legs climbed up the water spout. And as the rain came down, the spider went away. But then as the sun came out, there was still no spider to be found. And as the story goes, Mommy Long Legs was no more. That's not the story. <laughs> the short version of my story. So there was a spider. There was a very handsome black widow. Oh. <laughs> One day, sneaky little Mr. Black Widow <laughs> went out and met Mommy Longlegs. <laughs> what? Mommy Longlegs had really nice long legs oh. that Mr. Black Widow couldn't resist. I wonder where she's getting this story from. Like, <laughs> what? So Mr. Black Widow and Mommy Longlegs are bringing. Oh my gosh. Mommy Longlegs wanted to keep her babies safe. But Mrs. Black Widow found out what Mr. Black Widow did. Mrs. Black Widow ate Mr. Black Widow and was on the lookout for Mommy Long Legs. Oh my gosh. So Mrs. <laughs> Black Widow wasn't gonna let Mommy Long Legs get away with it. But Mommy Long Legs needed to keep her babies safe and she needed to stay alive for her babies. So Mommy Long Legs found a really nice little corner in the bathroom. Found a, a water spout. No, found a little corner in the bathroom. <laughs> Laid her eggs. Yeah, Mommy Longlegs went to the witness protection program oh, and became is. Daddy Longlegs. Yeah, nobody would expect Mommy to become Daddy. <laughs> what? Yes. So Mommy, Mommy is now Daddy. Daddy. And Daddy Longlegs was never a Daddy Longlegs. Oh my gosh, that's a, that gave me chills. <laughs> <laughs> that's a weird, weird, scary story. Some, some <laughs> twisted stuff you got. Okay. <laughs> She's definitely the better <laughs> storyteller, but I still kind of like mine. It's like... Who is most likely to go to a party just for the food? Just for the food? Boom. What are you looking at me for? Oh, <laughs> both of us. This is why we are married. Because we love food. And we love each other. It's this little triangular love. Pure, pure, 
What is pyramid. it? Pyramid that's going on. Or just a triangle. <laughs> a <little> pyramid? <laughs> okay. So hold on, hold on. Stop, stop, stop. Stop, stop. Okay. No, this next question's serious. Why? Stop smiling. <laughs> stop. Okay. Who would most likely be the one to smile first? <laughs> Dang it! I mean, I thought I would... I thought it would be me. I just... The reason I only put my name is because I just didn't want to be wrong, but... <laughs> but, but dang it! <laughs> uh. <laughs> Can we redo this one? Okay. Who's most likely to be the one to smile first? Look at me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's try that again. Okay. Who <laughs> is most likely to be the one to s s smile first? <laughs> wow, this is really hard. <laughs> but I won! <laughs> that was good. Okay, here it is. <laughs> Who is most likely to get hurt? Do we have any stories? Lots. <laughs> we just too many stories to tell. Oh, you know what? Can we tell the, the raspberry story? What's the raspberry story? The Winco story. Oh, sure. <laughs> Go ahead. So, here it is. We were in Winco, our favorite store. Mainly her favorite store. Both of ours. <laughs> um, we were in the produce section. This and like we were looking for... Ago, by the way. Now, it wasn't very long ago, so we were looking for a sweet potato. So in that sweet potato section, we're just, you know, paying attention to the potatoes. And Jazzy, like, with her right foot slips, her, like, legs go into, like, this, like, split. And this, like, wide split. And I'm, like, happening. I'm, like, is this, like, really happening? Are you just, like, joking? And then she, like, crashes, hits her knee. And it's still bruised. You can see how far it right. split. It was far. So you slip and with your right and down to your knee? Yeah. This ground's hard, too. It's yeah. all concrete, yeah, so. Yeah, I apologize. <laughs> Which direction were you walking? I was walking this way. <laughs> yeah, we just turned around from getting sweet potatoes. That was uh, crazy. So yeah, a lot of things could happen when you're at a place that you love. Um, <laughs> including falling and hurting your knee. It started burning and now right here is kind of hurting too. It's burning? Yeah. I don't know, maybe it like cut under- Yeah, sometimes like it skins underneath. Yeah. <laughs> so, oh, I'm so sorry. I did a split and but, then I Look at- Oh, look at how she's walking. Uh, and that's not because of her. This isn't her. This happened over there. <laughs> they take the cleanup job really seriously. That's a big machine. What do you say? She said, I like pastaroni. <laughs> Even though she just hurt her foot, she still finds joy. What? What did I say? My foot. Oh, no, I mean, no. Well, even though you hurt your knee. Okay, okay. Even though she hurt her knee, she still finds joy pasta. in pasta. Pastaroni. Look at that. How many? Four cheese corkscrew pasta. <laughs> Jazzy loves pasta. She will get as much as she could carry. I'll never do the keto diet. No, keto diet is not Jazzy friendly. Yes, you do love Roni. Pastaroni, rice Roni. What's your point? I never realized that there was a connection. Ronies. They're both Ronies. You just connected the dots. <laughs> Look at those little steps. What are you doing? What is going on in the mind of Jazzy? <laughs> Check it out. Look at all that stuff. This is why we come to Winco. Winco? Nice. One more. 126. Reasons why Winco, we win. Oh, okay, we're not getting out that way. <laughs> Way too many hurt stories. Yeah. Way too many scars. We are gonna make a little video about how many times Jazzy's gotten hurt. Who is most likely to give someone a handshake who wants a hug, so they go for the handshake, but then you go for the hug. <laughs> What's the matter with me? <laughs> yeah, it's I think it's Jazzy. I could just so see that happening. Who would most likely slowly put another dish in the sink while someone is doing dishes? <laughs> That's what I thought. Really? Yeah. Why are you putting my name? Well, because you've done that and you don't do the dishes. Okay, that's exactly why I, I was saying my name, so, okay. I just want to make sure we're on the same page here. 
All right, so that's all of them. I hope you learned something. I hope you learned something today. <laughs> the more you know. Oh, you know what? By the way, these little signs, and Jazzy made them like 15 minutes before we did this video, and check out how good they are. Like, those are good. She has the best handwriting you'll ever see in your life. It is so good. You're too kind. You are too good. You are great. You are so fantastic. You smell so coffee like. Do I smell like a coffee bean? Okay, guys. I think that concludes the video this time. Jazzy, Brennan, and friends, thanks for watching this video. We really appreciate you watching this. If you have any who's most likely to questions, go ahead and leave them in the comments and we'll comment back to you on who's most likely to do what? Me or Jazzy? Still ready. <laughs> not, depending on what this is, who's most likely to, I don't know. Eat a sock. Eat a sock? <laughs> what? No, we need to suck. Be, be nice with your questions. Don't be like, who's most likely to like not brush their teeth for a year? That would still be me. But like, hey, hey, let's just put that all aside. Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button because we super appreciate that. And hit that like button because we like you. We'll see you next time.